What's good? Chaos Nation, it is your boy Chaos here. Welcome back to some more Pokemon and Uranium episode 4, where we probably won't take on the gym leader, let's be fair. Uh, I'm doing some grinding this episode. I need to do some grinding, and uh, fortunately, I'm doing it live. So, not, I'm doing it live? No, I'm doing it on, uh, on VOD. So, um, I know a lot of people, like me, don't prefer to have these be, you know, really in videos. I usually tend to like to do them outside, but I don't have time this week, so I gotta do it now. And that's unfortunate. So, um, you have Sturdy. That's, I forgot you have that. So it might be important when I fight the rules to, uh, to tap them with my, uh, whatever they're, whatever it's called. My chippy. Go from there. That might be a good idea, but I, I need to get Chippy up some levels. I want I don't want Chippy to die just because I'm sacking it. I mean, I talked about just sacking it, but I don't want to be that guy. Chippy actually could be useful. So I'm going to let Chippy get some work um, put in. And uh, we'll, we'll see what Chippy wants to do with the team. 1.5 puts it at 75. I'm going to have to switch out anyway, so... Um, I guess I can get a little bit of help on the other guys on my team as well while doing this. So I gotta talk about fun stuff while the whole thing's going on and everything and why not. Because that's always amazing. So I love having to come up with random conversation topics. The game And the game can't really help me here, so I'm on my own. I'm on my own devices. It's obviously one of the hardest things to do as a content creator. Unless you're like, just can strike up random conversations with yourself. Try to come up with ideas to what to talk about and what to do. But it's very, very important to have an idea of what you want to talk about. I always jump into a video and I have no idea what, what, to, what to say. Like, I don't come in here planned with a list of things. I know one of the people I watched uh, when I was trying to get better at streaming and content. He, they suggested having some conversation topics to talk about and having, um, you know, questions to ask and questions to do. And, you know, if you ask a question today, you should have a question today written down before you start an episode. I never do that because I just come up with something on the fly. Um, or if you want to have a talk about something, like let's say today I'm talking about Pokemon. I mean, I picked something. Okay. You should have you should have an idea of what you want to talk about and what some points are, but obviously you want to make a conversation topic that you can talk about for a while. And I, I like how my conversation topics always go to like Twitch and YouTube 101. Like things you should be doing as a content creator to uh, improve yourself. And I, I don't feel bad about doing that because I know a lot of people who watch this channel are content creators. Most of them with less subscribers than me, maybe more followings in other places, but... You know, I know a lot of people are relatively new to YouTube and may or may not be making content. That was a crit, but but if you are making content, that's awesome. Keep doing it. You're doing great. Uh, if you're not making content, you want to make content, my easiest suggestion is just start because you're going to keep telling yourself no if you otherwise, so just do it. Um, and that's that conversation. I, I guess one thing I could talk about is the new people with uh, Invisible Corporations. Because I haven't got to talk about that on video yet. Um, I really haven't got to talk about it as of recording this on live stream. I haven't really said anything about it. Um, I know I, I did a little thing with... Uh, oh my gosh, stop critting me. I did a little thing that may be coming out at some point with somebody talking about stuff like this. Um, but I could give my opinions on it real quick. And... Um, so if you, if you aren't following my second channel first and foremost, you don't want to visit corporations. That's where you're first messing up because um, if you like me, if you like my mantra and my general status as a person of just the content I bring and the conversations I talk about and my, just my gameplay style and how I do series, I have another channel called Invisible Corporations. And it's funny that I mention this because I always consider it my second channel because if I didn't do it, I would have a second channel. Um, but yeah, you should check it out. I'm doing right now Skyward Sword on the channel if you want to watch that. I'm doing a playthrough of it. 
that's been already recorded and uploaded. So, yeah, I've beat the game, so I it's not I'm not free from spoilers. If you want to talk about Skyward Sword, you feel free to hit me up. Um, but I was talking about the new creators. Like we we did a, a bit of a inquiry lately, and I haven't talked about it on video. It kind of just you want icy stuff. Twitter, go to Twitter. I see twitter.com slash i uh, corporations. I believe is the uh, URL is the link for that. Down it up. It's down below. Go check it out. Uh, we did do an application process recently. Um, added three new members to our community, and um, I think it's going to be a cool time. I'm not used to having. I've always told Tui we don't really need more people and more people. And, we add three people, essentially doubling our current size. So, it's a little weird in that sense. You also have Gus, and I realized I switched out to a bug type. Which bad. Yeah, there it goes. Just as I was saying, hey, it's a bug type, don't use the berry. I can swap back in now, so that's good. That's the whole point, swapping it out. But we added um, people you might know, people who've in the comments, like, uh, like I would say Chaotic Wolfos, but you don't know. They're now Cyclonic Wolfos. You're welcome. Um, who's joined in? Uh, White's Kong, who you've seen in the comments. I just actually just did a multi with him um, last week. Or, uh, ooh, Gummy's learning Fairy Wind? That'll be really good. Yeah, for, um, it's still going on right now, I believe. The, uh, what's it called? Camp Yoha. So, we did a multi for that. Um, and then we added a friend of mine called Super Sharpness, who I've known personally. And so, we're excited to, I'm excited to see how they work together. I, like, I don't doubt any of them will fit. Don't, you have so many negatives in that sentence. Correct yourself. I think they will do well, and I think they will fit our vibe. So, I'm excited to see how it works out. Um, they're going to be uploading... Like how this is a little inf IC information video. They're gonna be starting upload in November. We're giving them some time to get like their first series done. Also, it's like it's literally the end of the month, so um, I think by the time this video comes out, it actually is November. Am I right? No, it's, ne it's next week. Next week's video is the first is Monday. So, um, oh yeah, you have charm, you but so. They'll be uploading in November, probably next week, so you should check out their stuff. I'd appreciate it. And uh, if you haven't checked out the content on the channel in the first place, you definitely should. A lot of people who um, I'm, I've close to, I've done content with in the past, like um, you know, Jimmy and I and uh, Louie did that one series. Louie's not a part of it at the moment, um, but Jimmy is on it, so if you want to watch more of Jimmy, you can check out that too. Tui, who I've worked with before, you know Tui, Tui and I created it, so, um, I'd say Tui and I created it, it was Tui, and I was just like, sure, let's not let it die, for whatever reason. Um, Damien, who's done stuff with us, so yeah, the people I've done collabs with pretty much are the ones that are on the channel, so, we will see about doing collabs over there and collabs here. I've done other series, you know, Tui and I have done... I don't know if two, two and I actually have not done a series on IC yet, just the two of us. That's kind of funny. Uh, but Damien and I did Sonic Heroes. Um, Jimmy and I did Star Fox. So if you want to see us in a different context besides Pokemon, that's a good place for it. Keep promoting Invisible Corporations. I need it. Tubi's going to love this video. Like, I should have like 20 comments for Tubi. He's like, yes, keep talking. Don't shut up ever. But I am excited to see new people join. It also just gives us a break if we need one. Because like, I don't have to. I'm already pre-uploading and everything. I record for that on my Twitch channel, which you should check out as well. Um, for for that content, just because I don't have time to, to record this series and any other things. So, um, speed because I am I'm going to be starting a new project here on the channel uh, next week, actually. So uh, we will have it'll be I think it's just Wednesdays. Yeah, I think I'm just going to upload on Wednesdays, so not really anything else behind that, but that'll be starting next week, I believe. So come check that out if you subscribe for that. So we'll have kind of a, com a, 
a content sandwich in the middle of the week. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I'm still trying to think about Saturdays. I know I've been very... If you're not following me on Twitter, if you're not in the Discord server, I do have community posts now on here, so I will be letting you guys know through that, too. But definitely go check out the other two, because you get content from them, too. And it's just an easy way to keep track of things. But now that I have the content tab, I'm definitely going to be using that more. Because I didn't realize it until they lowered it to 500, which... Thank you again for that. If you missed the 500 sub special... Uh, we play Pokemon Showdown. Uh, I originally was going to do 100 wins, but that just took too long, so... It might be like, 100 wins it might have been the video I posted a while ago, and... it's It ended up being 50, because I'm like... At the end of the first, like, two hours, I had like six wins, and I'm like, yeah. I'm not going to be able to sit here that long and do it, so I split it to 50, and... Found some ways to get through it a little bit faster. But I really appreciate you guys' support. Now, I wanted to give you something, and I thought, you know, we do... Like, I did competitive, and that was a lot of people's intro to me, so I, I wanted to do something that paid homage to the beginning of the channel, and yet something that was still fresh that people would watch. So, that's why we did that. But I, I there's a lot of really cool content coming out soon. There's a new series... Um, on here that's going to be coming out. I don't get a new series until on IC until December, but I've been recording a lot of stuff for between this channel and that channel for just content coming forward, and there's a lot of fun things going to be happening soon, so I'm really excited for those things. And I know a lot of my dialogue when I'm outside of things is outside of just talking about the game or talking about the specific issue or the specific topic. It's just content, and it's honestly because I'm really excited about it, and I want to share my excitement with you. If I ever get annoying, you know, you can always, you know, tell me, Hey, Chaos, shut up about content. We know you make content. Just play. Play the stupid game. Like, you can just do that. I mean, be nice about it. But still. But still. I do, I do hate grinding with the burning passion. And I think... Actually, that's a really good topic for this video grinding and how stupid it is. I understand the point of it in, like, some games where... You get the aspect of, like, okay... You know, you're trying to build... You're building a connection with the Pokémon, or you're building a connection with the character that you're grinding, or trying to get an achievement that'll help you, you know, beat a certain thing in a game. Which is essentially what we're doing. We're grinding levels so we can actually beat the ship. So, I understand it from that perspective, but the thing is, it just takes a lot of time and I'd rather be actually playing the game. Which is why I've always liked when Pokemon games have a way to kind of keep you on level as you go through it and not over level something or make you disregard something else. But you can kind of just keep your team on level. I'm trying to think of a game that does that really well and I don't really think there is a good example of Pokemon doing that. There's moments. There are moments. Definitely, like... Um, like, Johto does really good with keeping the levels kind of similar. I mean, you can go fight Price before you go fight Chuck if you want to. The problem is with that game is that the levels are too low, and there's not a lot of diversity, really, with that. Mankey's in this game. Forgot about that. I'm gonna swap, because I'm not trust of fighting type. But I don't like it because it wastes my time, essentially. And while I can, you can make the argument you build connection, I do that already. And I do that more so by crucial moments of the game, rather than sitting here clicking the A button 90 times in a row. So, I would prefer that method of building a connection, rather than grinding forever. And sure, you might want this achievement or that achievement or to get this level or to get that move or to get that item that you need. And that might be helpful for your run, but, you know, I've always been, I don't want to sit there for that long and do it. I mean, I honestly can talk about it in the past. I've done, and I think I did it, I did it in Heart Gold. And I did it in Emerald. And I do it in every solo project that I don't want to grind in. I just use for rare candies. And look, I know I'm not losing anything. 
Sometimes I actually do grind, but... I'm not gonna lose to a wild encounter, so that there's really... Help me, and besides, if you want me to grind, if you want me to legitimately grind, um, you're gonna miss episodes. That's just how it is. I don't have the time to, to grind. Like, if I was full-time, sure, I would grind. I would make myself do it. Probably do a live stream of that, honestly. But... I don't have the time to sit down and just do grinding for hours and hours on end. Like, I have to, uh... I have other things to do, I have classes to work on, I have homework, and... Other content that I need to be working on because I have life and a job, and... I think some... Some viewers don't understand that... That aspect of things. Sure, it's a half an hour video, but, and you might see it like half an hour video, but the time it takes to actually like record that, edit it, upload it and everything, you know, you're probably putting in like two or three hours for a half an hour video of a Let's Play. Now like my 10 minute Saturday videos that I've been doing, or so, those take like triple the time. Like sometimes those are six hours in the making. It depends on how much research I have to do to find things, or how much prior knowledge I have that I, I can rely on, or what kind of... I don't know... editing I have to do with it. They just take a while. And since I'm not full-time and I don't have a hired editor, I am my editor. Love that guy. He does a lot of good work. Since I don't have the time to, to do all that kind of stuff, I gotta make make things easier for me where I can, and grinding is one of those places that I just generally don't enjoy doing, and kind of get away with not doing, but I don't know how to do it in this game, so I'm not going to attempt to break it by putting rare candies in the game. So, I might do a few of these legitimate and grinding videos, and I'm trying to make them interesting, so if you have a, a conversation topic that you'd like me to talk about while doing this, you can leave that in the comment down below. That's question of the day. What would you like me to talk about if I do grinding videos? And I know a lot of people just skip them and go over them and honestly I believe I have of the mind that a content creator can make anything interesting if they put their mind to it. So it's not about just oh the video the game's boring. You're literally mashing A. Nobody wants to watch that. Kinda why I do shiny hunting on stream, you know? It's cause you know, I can con I can talk to people, and I'm just not just sitting there resetting until something turns a different color. Like, I would get very bored with that. But having an outlet like this to, to talk to people and stuff works. And I very, 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 very much understand people who think grinding is boring. But if you're watching the gameplay, you're missing half the you're missing honestly like 90% of the content, man. My commentary is like what I'm making bank on, honestly. That's how I see it. And so if my commentary sucks, then people aren't gonna watch. But if my gameplay is terrible and my commentary is awesome, you're not really gonna care that much. I mean, honestly, you're probably out in the background doing dishes right now, or, you know, got me on headphones while you're walking to work or walking home from work or something. Like, you're probably not watching the video. You're listening to it. And I'm guilty of it myself. So, having the vocals to, to talk about things that are going on or just have a conversation works well. And I've had a lot of experience with it because over the last, what, five years, six years? What is it, 2021? Yeah, five years. As I started my channel in 2016. I've had a lot of solo projects. I've done this pretty much since I started the channel. Just me talking to a video game or to a camera while mashing it and stuff and I, I like I hope I got better over it over the years I mean I've watched my old content man does it suck which I don't understand why people still watch it uh, and why people are like I want to go back and watch the old stuff I mean you can if you want to laugh at it and see oh my gosh this is garbage you know and I, I do always say that if, if you're a content creator you should always be making positive strides forward to increase the quality of your content. Yeah, we're not gonna get to the gym today. I just don't think so. What level am I actually? I'm nine and 
We, we, we can jump in there. We can see what we do. I mean, I got Shippy leveled up, so I feel a little bit better about things now. Let's go say hi. Let's go say hi. I, I'm... Uh, you can see how fast I get tired of grinding, by the way. Right there. Look, I've told you this before. I'm not a champion anymore, alright? I'm retired. I'm just a gym leader now. But Maria, you were the strongest trainer in Tandor. So talented, so young and beautiful. Why would you throw away all that fame? Your fans still love you. I'm not interested in being famous anymore. I just want to lead a normal life. Run my gym and... Have not to deal with creeps like you. Seriously, it's okay to make copies of people. It's not okay to make copies of people's housekeeps. I'm calling the Rangers. No, please. I, I'll leave you alone. I promise. Good. You aren't allowed in my gym anymore. Get lost. Don't make me say it again. Weirdo. Don't lose Tucker. Sorry you had to see that. I'm normally a, not an angry person, you know? But once you win the Tandor Championship, you can never escape it. Everyone knows your name. Sometimes it's not enough to make me want to skip town, but then who would run the gym? Speaking of that, I know you're here for the normal badge. That's the name of the badge. I mean, it's not the balance badge when you have a bunch of slackings on your team, so that's fair. Make sure wait long enough. Come inside and show me your skills. Show your moves. Please have trainers. Cool. Howdy, trainer. This is your first gym. You must be excited. I'm called the gym guy. You're called Clyde the guide. Get it right. You deliver tips and aspiring trainers conquer the Tandor League. Maria is a normal type Pokemon. Water normal types aren't super effective on any other type. We also have a few weaknesses. Fighting type like Makey is strong here. And steel type like Orkinix, and well, I wish I had one of those. It's a Nuzlocke though, and I don't get lucky and get things that are actually useful. And he gives me a fresh water. Cause... Alright, let's start going through it. You can obviously skip these trainers. Hi, you think you have a taste for the beats Maria? Let me be the judge of that. Yeah, I definitely need to... I'm using these kind of as training, too. Alright, level level 8. That's what I would expect. I'm on par. Gummy? Gummy is not a fairy type yet. Gummy's just a bug type, so... Um, fairy wind's not going to be that great. Oh, that is a stab tackle. And Sheenamuk's not that weak. So. Yeah, I've kind of noticed that Gummy is the weak link of my team here. Um, I'm not really good at this moment of time, because there's a lot of flying types that I'm weak to. And I don't really have a good damage output like that. Uh, I'm not really doing much here with Gummy. And there he's boosting a special defense there. Why did I not get charged at level? I might have, I just missed it. Yeah, I'm not doing anything this guy. Fortunately, Gummy's kind of behind. I'm going to train Blitz. My whole plan was to just kind of swap the Blitz over and over and over again. So I can potentially get level 13 by the end of this. I don't think I'm going to get there. Yeah, he's just boosting his special defense, which is really bad because I was going to use special attacks. But I do have um, attack. He withdraws. He wants to get rid of that attack stat. That's fine. NPCs. I forgot NPCs have good AI in this. And you're just going to spam quick attack. You see, you're annoying. But now you're dead, so you don't have to worry about it. Unfortunately, Cub... Our Cub flies... Our Cubby is not getting... Cub bug. It's not getting, uh, levels from that. So... Now you can't switch, and I can charm you with no problem. So I gotta take one. I think that actually knocked us into room barrier range, which is unfortunate. Yeah, I did. I'd rather not have it pop there, but sure. I'm back to Blitz. And as long as you don't start charging, we should be okay. Okay. So I do think I'm... As long as he doesn't go plus two, I think I'm good. To use Water Gun. Do some damage. Because it is still stab. I, yeah, now we gotta go with tackle. I think tackle's more effective now because we're getting half damage. Even with stab, it's not. We're not breaking through that. But that's fine. So, Chicken Monk can be annoying. That's good to know. Especially if I. I mean, I had the fence scroll. Oh, Blitz now. So Defense Girl Blitz might be the play through this. You have another Chi and Monk? 
go back out the gummy. Yeah, Blitz might be a play here. So, I think this is, I'm gonna wrap up after this battle. Again, I don't have a lot of time today, I kinda got busy doing some other things and got to recording late, so I need to get to stream, and I am streaming early, so... Fortunately, I can't. I wanted to do like I wanted to do the four episode thing again, but I just I don't have the time. So the point is, I think I'm ahead on Saturday content right now, but I don't have to worry about that too much. Because usually I'll spend like the Saturday. I'll spend Wednesdays usually my Wednesday morning on my upload or my recording times. So if I'm got two videos done, if I got four videos done a week, um, I could spend. The next Wednesday, instead of recording this series, I can be you know, making a Saturday video. So I'm going to try to do that and maybe make the Saturday content every other week. I know I've been kind of shoddy about that lately. But expect every other week from, from here on until at least I'm done with classes for the semester. So that's, that's probably what you're going to end up getting from it. Now I get static. Always when it doesn't matter. So probably be every other week for Saturday content, um, just because I can get ahead on this a little bit and then go from there. So I, I, I mean, I specifically section off Wednesday mornings to get content done, and fortunately I have a lot of work to do this week, so I'm definitely not getting another recording for that done. Yeah, there will be one this week. And I think there's one the week after, actually. So I'm not sure how far ahead I am. No, there'll be one this week. I have that recorded. The week after would be, yeah. The, there's not going to be one next week, but there'll be one this week. Because I got a few done while I had uh, my fall break. So uh, We'll continue the gym in the next episode. So thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed today's video. I know it's a little bit different from what I usually do. And different in the sense that I'm not just playing the game, I'm grinding a bit, and you know, some people don't like that. But answer the question of the day down below, hit that like button if you enjoyed, hit that subscribe button if you guys are new and you haven't done so already. I know like 70% of you guys are not subscribed, so actually it's closer to 80 I think than 70. It's like 80% of you guys are not subscribed, I know a lot of people watch the best team and stuff, so uh, I shouldn't be talking about it on that video. So. Unfortunately, I can't retroactively go back and be like, hey, subscribe, and yeah. But if you are subscribing and you're enjoying the content, there's no reason for you not to because it just gives you the notification when a video comes out. You have a, instead of having to find it, you get it. So uh, if you want to see more of me, that's a great way to do it. And I really would appreciate it. As well as joining our communities on Discord, following me on Twitter. Um, obviously, go and check out IC and subscribing over there if you want to see more of my content. Not Pokemon, and all of my other links are in the description down below. You can check all those out. TikTok's down there too if you want to catch some fun content from me, highlights and whatnot. So definitely check all of that out. I would appreciate it, and I'd love to interact with you guys more outside of just the comment section here. So if you're a comment homie, come check out some of the other stuff. Join us over there, and if you're already on the other stuff, that's awesome. But I appreciate you guys checking out the videos. Obviously, you can spend your time doing whatever and you choose to watch this. So it means a lot to me. And continue to help us out by sharing it with your friends. So we can get more people in our awesome community. Thanks for being awesome. I appreciate you guys. See you next time. Until then, my name is Chaos and I'm signing off. Stay safe. And as always, 